Hi friends and welcome to Take Two for this Tuesday the 17th of December 2019. I'm Jeannie. So glad you decided to come along for the ride today. Well, the last couple of days I have been rapping, rapping, rapping. I'm not talking about singing songs in rhyme. No, no, no. I'm talking about this kind of rapping. Rapping gifts. Oh, have I been rapping gifts. <gasps> so many. Because, you know, I had a deadline. I had to get stuff in the mail because our gifts are, are uh, most of our gifts are being shipped to other places. Now, we don't have anybody locally here in Southeast Alabama. We have some friends, of course. But I mean, as far as like having to get stuff in a box, get it to the post office, get it shipped off, get it there on time, that's a lot of work. And if you don't do it within the parameters of the time, unfortunately, there won't be anything to unwrap on Christmas morning. So I had to be sure that I got it. So I got out all my trusty scissors and I got the tape and, and I got all the packing stuff and I got the bubble wrap, the big industrial size bubble wrap, <laughs> everything that I needed to get this done. And you know what? I'm so excited to say I I got it all done. I got it all packed. I got it all shipped off yesterday, and that's good. But then there's a few local folks that we have a few gifts for, so the wrapping continues. There's still ribbons to be to be tied and and tape to be put on and and uh, and cards, some cards to be written out, special cards to friends, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. It's so important that you get it done on time. But here's the thing. There's so much more, as you well know. I know that I'm preaching to the choir here because so many of you, of my viewers, of my friends, know there's so much more of a reason for the season. But there's something so very special, especially when you've got children, when you can wrap things and just to see their faces. And I must say, thank you, Jackie, to my niece, because what she'll do, God bless her, is when she sees that a package has come through from Uncle Michael and Aunt Aunt Jeannie to her children. She videotapes while they're opening the packages and I get to see their faces even though I may be a thousand miles away. I get to see their faces a few minutes after they've looked, opened these packages and there's so much gratitude. I must say, of course, Thomas is still small. He's only a year and a half. But Jimmy, since he could talk and, and, and show emotion and let us know what's going on, he is so grateful and thankful and he gets so excited because of that excitement of opening gifts. You know, boys and girls, we should be just equally as excited about everything going on connected with this season, especially the giving part. The, you know, when you're little, it's the receiving part most of the time. But when you get older, it's the giving part. If I never got another gift again in my life, I could care less. Michael and I even just give each other like token things, you know, or we'll enjoy a meal out together, that sort of thing. Because we know that there's, it doesn't, it's not necessarily necessary for us to give each other presents. But there's something so special when you see the faces of those you love receiving and appreciating what you've given them. So I have to say thank you to Jackie and uh, the way she's raising those children and then also to Rachel and uh, and AJ, uh, my other niece and her husband and children uh, just because they're so grateful too. And Jim, I'll mention Jim, Jackie's husband also. I'm just so grateful grateful that they've taught their children well to be appreciative and grateful and also to give. And that's another thing. They give back and they help with charitable things and, and they help with uh, needy children and they understand about Toys for Tots and the Salvation Army uh, um, kettles and all that. And I'm so grateful that they're being taught that as well. So listen, it's not just giving, it's also receiving, and it's not just receiving, it's also giving. So make sure whatever realm you're in, uh, that you think about the other side as well, okay? Does that make sense? Now, go out and be a blessing to somebody today. You might end up being the only one who is, and if you know somebody that you just need to wrap a little something and drop over, whether it's cookies or whether it's uh, just a little, you know, a little something, maybe a little coupon that says, I'll uh, I'll do some errands for you or something like that. I, a lot of people will hand out hug coupons, which is always a good thing too. 
just go out and be a blessing because you really may be the only one who is today, okay? And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, Jeannie Sigler, J-E-A-N-N-E-S-I-G-L-E-R. Hit that notification bell and uh, hit that subscribe button. You'll be notified every time another Take Two is posted. Mm, I love you all very much. Listen, you be blessed. Have a great day. And uh, if you haven't done all your wrapping and mailing, uh, the deadline is today. So get out there and do that, okay? Especially in the U.S. mail. And, uh, and I will uh, see you tomorrow for hump day, okay? Bye-bye.